I want to show you how to assemble the face mask. Uh, this is the part that you need that you make with the machine. Uh, besides the part, you need two small rubber bands and a little larger uh, rubber band to um, to hold uh, some of the parts. And it's very simple. Uh, here on this part, you need to attach these parts like this. It have a, a little cut that goes inside the um, the acrylic like this, so it it stays in place and don't move up and down. After you put the three parts, you have to put one of these. Um, uh, on the design, you you can feel that have a small pocket on one side. So this pocket goes. Uh, to uh, to this side up or this side down, so it holds the the clip on place. So I'm going to put the um, this is the uh, the pocket. I'm going to put this pocket towards that side. So it's going to be like this. And <coughs> now <coughs> I can adjust this. So they stay inside the pocket, and now with one finger I press this towards the <coughs> the, the other part, and I insert this part here, and it gets inside the other pocket, so it stays in place, and that's it. It's like a clip. These parts are are make a are designed to to make this thicker, this this part thicker. So when you put the um, the mask uh, on your forehead, um, these um, have more surface to stand. That's the only reason for this part. If you if you design only this line, this will <coughs> this will hurt uh, your forehead. No matter if you put this. Okay. So next next is to hold this uh, this part. This part it's it's uh, make have a pocket make made with a laser and have the the same pattern as the um, as this. So when you put it, it goes like this. So it's a very nice fit, and that's how uh, it stays here. Now. Could be the possibility that this this can uh, get loose, so that's why you need the small rubber bands to put them here against this cut. So it's very simple. You grab the rubber band, you open the rubber band, you put it here, put it here, and that's it. You stay in place. Now the other one, do the same. Open the rubber band and stay there. So that's very simple very easy and stay in place and you can put it uh, on your head and if this gets uh, dirty you can take it out and clean it that's a, that's one of the advantages not using any glue and uh, also you can you can make several for each each mask so you can give them away with several replacement parts like this and if they get used they can throw it away and, and put a new one because this part made uh, uh, can be disinfected many 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 times and it doesn't get damaged now the holding part here here you have a, uh, <coughs> two pockets one here and one here the pockets are on the outside of the of the mask to put these parts so <coughs> when you put one of the parts here you have to put it from the opposite side like this and it enters the pocket. Now, because it's going to go operate this, this side, it, it doesn't came out because it doesn't have the pocket on that side. And the other side, you do the same. Preferably, the, uh, this part needs to be up. So if you're going to put the mask like this, because everything is symmetrical, can be used like this or like this. So, if, uh, if you're going to put the, the mask like this, this has to be up. It's better. 
Now, the rubber band, how to hold this, it's very simple. You put the rubber band here on the hole. You pass it through, through the same rubber band. You take a little, and that's it. That's how you hold it. You can, you can um, have more tension if you like. Uh, but um, it, it will depend on the, on, on the size of your head and this fits very very nice on many sizes of head and it doesn't hurt or anything okay now the um, the plastic cover the pet cover uh, the design it also makes two covers at the same time uh, and make this cut, this cut, this cut on the center and make these little holes here to, to hold it. The holes have a special design with two small cuts on the side and one uh, small <coughs> kind of circle in the center. It's a rectangle with the round edges. And these parts, this part is very simple. You just make this and remove it. And remove it and you have the round edge here now to remove the um, the small cuts you may need something with a small hole and for example I'm going to use some scissors and press this like this and there it's remove it now the next one why you need the hole because you need some support to, to remove this this little uh, leftover there you go okay now we remove these three parts we have the holes and the holes <coughs> fit perfectly here you put the the middle one first so when you press it it will open the sides and then close it the sides so it doesn't move away then after the center you put one of the sides then the other side and that's it that's how the mask uh, finish so it's not difficult, it's very simple to make. Uh, remember that if you're going to deliver this to someone, you have to use gloves and disinfect everything before you assemble these parts. Uh, so the, the people are completely safe uh, using this. Uh, or you can deliver them without assembly, but uh, it's important to disinfect everything. So you don't spread anything. Um, okay, so thank you for watching. I hope this uh, helps some people. Take care.